Hi and welcome to this quick video where we're going to show you how to put together the UniGeek Unicorn Badge Kit uh, from Protopic. Now, this is the finished product here, so you've got a nice colourful silk screen there. It's quite a simple kit to put together and you can see it will have this RGB, sort of rainbow effect, colour cycling LED on it to go with the rainbow effect main there on the Unicorn or the UniGeek. So, First of all, what you want to do is check everything's in the kit. So you should have your PCB, your battery clip, your pin back, the pin, oh, the pin and a single LED. Now, firstly, once you've checked everything's there, you want to turn your PCB over. And the first thing you want to add is the, the battery clip. So first up, you get some solder and your iron. So I've got it here. So, tinning your iron, you want to apply heat to one pad for the battery and sort of flood that pad with solder. And then you will need pliers or something to hold these parts because they do get very hot. So what you want to do is place that over there. Like that. And then if you hold it down gently, bring your iron over and heat it to melt the solder underneath. And that should hold it in place. Now don't worry if it looks a bit messy just now. We'll tidy it up afterwards. And that's one battery on. So what you want to do, uh, one battery clip, sorry. You want to flood into the little hole there so it wicks down onto the pad. And you can see it wicking through there and then let go. As that cools, we come over to this side and apply more solder for a bit more mechanical strength. So that's the battery clip installed. Next up we want to do the pin. We want to do all the components in the back first because when we come to do the LED it would be awkward with the LED in place. So. Or rather, it would be awkward to do it with the LED in place to add these components. So we flood some solder in there, so that this pad's nice and tinned. And then we want to get the pin. Now I find it easier to do this with my right hand, because I'm right-handed. So you want to hold the pin with a pair of pliers. Then I'll take the iron in my left hand and I'll apply heat to this solder that we've already placed here and then let that melt. So let's add heat and then take the heat away and wait for that to cure or cool. And you may want to add a little bit more solder just to make sure it's nice and mechanically strong. There we go. And that is the pin. Now remember that will be very hot so you don't want to be touching that. Next up is the LED. So you can see here it says short leg, long leg and we put the silk screen on the back for the LED although the LED will be going on the other side we didn't want to get the image and whatnot on the front of the unicorn so short leg to the top so we put it in like that all the way down and then just double check once it's through that your short leg is where it says short leg and what we want to do is just tack on one leg of the LED so tin my iron and then like that and you want to make sure it's sitting flush which that one is, but if it wasn't, you would just holding it like this, heat that pin up again, and then push it down, and it would sit nice and flush. Take away the heat, hold your finger there, and wait for the the solder to go hard. And then finally, the second pin of the LED. There we go. 
can see that soldered there, so we take a pair of cutters or snips, whatever you want to call them. Now, what I do is I place my index finger on the pin that I'm going to cut, and then I snip it away, and that stops it flying off. And there we go. So that's your Uni Geek badge kit all soldered up. And then simply add a battery in the bottom, attach it to the front of your clothes using the pin back, like that. And you'll have something that looks like this. And it looks pretty cool. Thanks very much. Bye.